amongst every lot of GoBots or Transformers um, you get, you inevitably come across a converter. So it was little diecast mini cars. They're like, you know, cheaper than GoBot GoBots, right? And they were imported versions of uh, mini cars by a company called uh, Mark out of Japan from a line called the Goken Robo, believe it or not. So they were the original um, Goken Robo cars from Mark. And then there was the converters and converters had the was a mix of the original line and then the next line called American Robocar. But not only that, these were also produced by several other companies, one of which um, was called Village Toys. Now, Village Toys um, is a, a Korean company, I believe, and their version of it was called Convertibots. Now, wave one of the Convertibots was essentially just repackaged converter mini cars as, as far as i know they're basically the same but wave two is there's very little information about them and i think this is a wave two uh, i have never seen this guy in the package i don't know his name the uh there's one called like corvette and it's just a corvette so what is this a uh, firebird camaro I, I really don't know cars too much but it's something like that right this uh, is a really interesting piece, and I, and I would love to know more about it from anyone who happens to know more about it. My, this one's actually broken, but it's just so cool I have to kind of show it off, right? Um, so it's an entirely die-cast body. The arms, are, the arms are plastic. The wheels are rubber. You know, and it still rolls around great for like 1984, 1985. Transformation is simple, but I, I, it's weird, right? And to do this, I need to kind of fake it a little bit because this is broken at these connection points. You can see right here, these pieces, they're supposed to be connected and they're very small. So what I have to do basically is kind of pull them out just, in, just as much as they'll come out and then kind of just figure out how far that these are gonna go. Um, and so I'll do that off camera because it's a little messy. All right, so that's pretty good. There's still some friction in there, but that's fine. Um, they don't come out sideways, but you can just see how like, the, the insides are broken. But then this section turns, and that basically those become the feet. Um, they're lame, right? It's not exciting, right? It's just kind of low effort transformer. Another thing I'll say about... Uh, and I think this was in some of the other models, but Koreans uh, were big on Taekwon V. That's like their national superhero robot. And I wonder if this V molded in is uh, in tribute to that. But anyways, uh, next part is just, you know, arms come out. Very GoBot-ish, and its arms come out, and there's, you know, little kind of, you kind of see the hand in there. But here's the crazy shit, right? This is where it gets like, what the fuck? The head comes up here, right? See that little head there? But check this out. There's another head. This robot's got two heads. <laughs> this is like, what is this, right? It's just crazy. It's it's ugly, right? And like, I, I th I, you think that this should be the way, but uh, I don't know, like, why would they put that joint in there if it wasn't f to turn it around? I don't know, man, this thing is, nuts and i've never seen it before i've never seen anything like it like I w it's just so obscure um if you have information about this if you have a picture of it in the package if you know its proper name please tell me i'm dying to know more about this i know there's a blue car in the line but i want to know if there's more was there only two releases or are there more and are they based on a Japanese version, which I've never seen? This this seems this seems Korean, right? Like this is like a Korean thing. <laughs> Not that the Korean toys are are fine now, but back in the day they were lacking and they did some crazy shit. So I, it feels like that's what this is. But um, yeah, wow, well, mental, right? It's obscure. It's missing. A, there was a sticker on this roof that's gone. Um, that's all I know, right? So if you know more, leave a comment. Let me know. It's kind of kooky, and I love it, and I want to know more. And I want to know if there's any more, and then I want to buy them. It's Josh at Collection DX. Uh, jump on our Patreon and throw us a couple bucks. 
subscribe, tell your friends, whatever you like. Appreciate it. Bye.